Well, in my opinion, it's to research the job that you're actually going to be doing as much as you can, so you've actually got an idea of what you're letting yourself in for, I suppose. Um, also, if, actually try and read up on what the apprenticeship, uh, what the assessment um, entails. Like, for example, our assessment day involved us doing things like climbing and taking things apart and putting them back together again. So you need to be prepared for things like that. Say, if you haven't really done that, have that as sort of background already, you need to be prepared for doing things like that that maybe you might not be comfortable with. Do as much as you can. Um, read up. I, I read up on the, the website. Um, I asked people around the company, um, spoke to engineers, just to try and get a bit of insight on the actual job itself. But it's just prepare as much as you can. You can never prepare enough for interviews. You're always going to be nervous, you're always going to be fidgety. Well, I prepared, um, first of all, just researching the company that you're actually applying for. Um, they're possibly going to ask you questions about what you already know, uh, about what the company does, uh, its goals, its aims, things like that, your, your job roles and responsibilities. So just have a look, uh, even just on the internet, uh, through their web pages, and just do a little bit of background research, first of all. Um, if there's any practical elements to it, which there was in mine, um, perhaps just try and get yourself uh, in doing some hands-on things in sort of the weeks and months before. Uh, I know in mine, I used to work in a sports shop uh, selling fitness equipment, so when I knew I wanted to apply for the job, uh, I just started to actually build the equipment a little bit more rather than sell it, so it just gave me a chance to uh, get my hands on some tools, uh, just so that I wasn't sort of too nervous by the time I got here. Uh, really, the whole assessment day for myself was all about preparation and ensuring that you're really ready to go on the day and that starts really, you know, the week before, doing your homework about the role, going online, researching the job itself, uh, finding out where the actual uh, assessment is being held to ensure that you're given enough time on the day to arrive, getting yourself appearance-wise, getting that spot on. Be organised, make sure you know what you're going to do, where you're going and what you're going to say and stay calm, don't panic, it's the worst thing you can do. I use the British Gas website and try to find out a bit more about the company because I knew that was going to be part of the interview and then I also just prepared a bit before the night before made sure I was ready for it all.